here's the back, you're gonna see the connections. You just have HDMI, you've got Ethernet, so you could hook it up directly to your router using a cable. Most of you will not do that, we'll just use Wi Fi. And 3D for just streaming stuff, I doubt that you're gonna use Ethernet, but you can. And right here, that's just for your power, that's where you're gonna hook it up. Other than that, there's nothing else all the way around your Apple TV, as you guys can see right now. There's literally nothing, nothing all the way around. Now, if you look at the bottom of the Apple TV, that's just for ventilation, because we do need some ventilation. These things can get a little bit hot. And just to answer a really quick question from a few people that asked me in my channel, does this come with Netflix and Prime and all that other stuff? Well, you can download that from the App Store right here on Apple TV. So it doesn't come pre-installed with those things, but you can definitely download them yourselves and it is free. Now, obviously the service itself, like Netflix, or maybe Disney or Prime or anything like that, you would have to pay for those services because those are channels, those are services. And if you're thinking about Apple TV Plus, the channel itself, well, that's also different than this. This is a device that hooks up to your TV. Apple TV Plus is a channel where you guys can view a lot of stuff actually now. Before, they didn't have that much. Right now, they have more and more stuff in there. And if you're thinking about the Apple TV, the app itself, well, the app is actually can be found in almost everywhere. Not everywhere, but almost everywhere. Now that app is just a hub. It's a hub for you guys to look up. If you're looking from a particular movie, for example, you can search that up in the hub and the hub will point you out everywhere that you could watch that particular movie, for example, that you're looking for. But that's the app itself. So I did want to highlight those differences while I'm doing this type of video because I get that question a lot. What's the difference between Apple TV Plus, Apple TV, the app, and the device? This is the device right here. So that's the Apple TV. This is the controller it comes with. Pretty basic. We do have Siri as just the older ones did. Uh, power, you can move things around. You have your volume, volume. This from your menu, just to go back. And on the back is just your basic Apple logo. In the bottom, you're going to see your charging port. So you don't need to worry about batteries. And that's about it when it comes down to the actual controller that comes with your Apple TV. Anyways, that would be it for this video. If you guys have any comments, questions, you guys can write down here in comments area. Don't forget to subscribe and rate. Thank you.